what happens is the first muscles that fire, and I don't care what movement it is, are your core muscles. And these core muscles, the, the purpose of them is to increase the negative pressure in this, what we call the interabdominal cavity. All right? So once you have that negative pressure, and you know, you could think of um, like a plunger if you, or like a suction cup, you stick it to a, um, a window. Why does that stick to the window? It's because there's that negative pressure, that, that vacuum effect that's created, which creates stability and control. So there's no movement between the plunger and the, um, and the window. That's, in effect, what happens here. So these small, mus small muscles in the core fire first, and then the second and third wave of muscles to fire are going to be your arms and your legs. But what happens is we screw that up because of the poor posture, because of the old injuries, these muscles don't fire effectively during our movements. So we end up getting more peripheral muscles, and I'm talking about mainly hamstrings, trapezius. When we go to move our body, these muscles fire first to try to grip and control this pelvic area to, to create that, that stability and control that we need to move. But so you get inappropriate tension of more peripheral muscles, because they're going to control the muscles. And then these guys, they fire second, third, or not at all. Right? So that starts kind of this snowball effect of where we have inappropriate, um, inappropriate stability created from more peripheral um, body parts. 